Did I forget anything? Good lord, that is loud. Okay. I'm not gonna leave that. Uh, audio. Yeah, yeah, so let's just. Like these. Like these, like these, like this. This. Uh, sounds good. It's really loud in my way. Okay, I'm just gonna play this through. Wait, back. On a little late. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Hey, Lexicor. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. So employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor in his desk. That sounds him what like the life. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> hey, I'm Zaggy. How's it going? 427 did every day of every month of every year. Yeah. Hey, Don. It soul-lifting, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. Sorry, I'm on a little late. Was happy. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. I can't remember it. He had been at his How desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for uh, him to follow. This game no sucks. <laughs> call a meeting oh, Never you're the reason I'm on late. I hope you know. I I get that thing. My my computer like decides to configure last second. I'm like, no. And then I get on. It's like, you should stream this today. Thank you, man. You didn't have to get this game for me. <laughs> so I didn't install it. I felt obliged to install it and play it. And I really wanted to. <laughs> so thank you for the game. What? I didn't listen to him. What does he want from me? No. Close that. But Stanley simply couldn't handle the pressure. What if he had to make a decision? Close that. What if a crucial outcome fell under his responsibility? Do you have PC or P uh, I've never been it's PC? No. I don't this have uh, PS3 badly. or PS4. The thing to do now, Stanley thought to himself, I have very me. little room to uh, move my mouse. In here, I can right here. Forever, I will be happy. Stanley Hours passed, then days. Had years gone by? He no longer had the like ability to do it. But the one thing he knew All right. for sure. <laughs> it would be better if you played it. I just rage. I played it. <laughs> eventually, someday, I don't know what's going on because I'm not listening. <laughs> soon, very soon now, it's a game that you really have to. He will be spoken to. He will be told what to do. Can I? Now it's just a little <laughs> I bit drop closer. Stuff. Now it's even closer. Here it comes. What? Did it just restart already? Oh no. <laughs> it's like all I did was close the door. It's like, nah, I'm just gonna stay in here. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. We haven't met, met the all 700 mark yet. Gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard He's Stanley really looked, he couldn't he find a that. trace of his co workers. <laughs> They look weird on your ears. Well, I have a pierce. They don't look weird. They don't look weird. Oh, hey, Des. And Puma. No, this is. This is just. <laughs> what? His red one's coming. Okay. Thank you. Can I open other doors? Okay, I'm not used to keyboard. I'm still not used to it. Even with a very little daisy. <laughs> All right, let's keep them going. I'm gonna do it 
the right way through because I haven't seen it that way yet. So I'm gonna do, can you go in there? No. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors. Oh, uh, hey, he did the I say hey, Ronan? The, the left. Okay, I have to listen to him. Ugh. I have very, like, <laughs> shh. It's all, like, can you just fucking go in? Yet there was I might no rage, just because I'm using a canvas <laughs> to hold my keyboard. Hoping he might find an answer there. Okay, so go through. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. <laughs> God, it's all sketchy on me. I'm gonna put my mouse pad on it. It's so it's sketchy because it get, keeps on like, getting caught on stuff. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, this game is gonna Stanley annoy you more than that. <laughs> I don't think that's mounted. possible. What he could not have known that horror mod literally had me running in circles. Desk, guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Two, eight, four, five. But of course, Stanley eight. couldn't possibly have known this. Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer Oh, shit. <laughs> sure luck. The newly opened passage. Would only have to be sure luck. I have to go down. What do you do in this game? It's it's kind of like a play. A, I want to say it's like a play against the narrator. The narrator will tell you to do stuff. Like as the story goes along, and you can you can choose whether to do it or not. To question the nature of his job. This round through, I'm going to go ahead and follow everything. It, it kind of tells the story a bit. I want to say you kind of play against him. It's really it's Stanley walked straight ahead through the funny. large door that read Mind Control Facility. It's really a light in my room. I'm getting a glare. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret! You, you remember she, she wouldn't get annoyed as you're screaming at the game. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably be screaming at the game. <laughs> it's it's half because I don't literally listen to what he says. Uh, I probably should, and I probably wouldn't be now wondering to what to do next. Their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building, Stanley's co-workers. Like, the lives of so many like individuals reduced to images on a screen, and Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. You want to slap the narrator? <laughs> yeah, screw that narrator. This mind screw him and his voice. Facility. All right. It was too horrible to believe it couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? He's not so much Captain Obvious as he's no, trying to narrate a story he to believe it. He and tell you kind of what, he's what you're supposed in to do. someone else's control? Never! It was unthinkable, wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Ugh. Oh no. It was 
bulletproof, the heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy What's or sad or content. Walking, this button. Eating, working. All of it is there not a run button? I think we've discussed this. And as There's the a cold reality of his run. past began to sink in, Stanley decided Four. that this machinery would never again exert its what terrible was the... power there was an over eight another in it. Never mind. human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. What? What? What's the? You can tell me the code. Button. 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 He's got the button. I know it's gonna be over here. Ooh, there's a big button. Hi, what is this game? This is the Stanley Parable. Not bad, not bad. Oh, hey, Psycho. Let's go in and fix her. An OB freak. Unless I can play with the controller. I don't think so. And when at last he found the source of the room's power, he knew it was his duty, his obligation, to put an end to this horrible place and to everything it's What happens if you put on? Do I just go back? If it on PC shift control. To to run? Is that true? No. Nah, I'm I'm scared to let's crouch. <laughs> I think it was just control though. Control is to go. Wait, wait. Okay. Let's put it off. It's a similar of annoyance. <laughs> Test your patience and annoying and Let's see how well my patience is. <laughs> I see something. What is yes. that? He had won. Is that light? He had defeated the machine. So unshackled himself from someone else's command. Freedom was mere moments away. And yet, even as I thought the there was a slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. There was more to it than his co-workers gone. How had he been freed from the machine's grasp? What other mysteries did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, something's gonna happen like right as it's like, hey, dead. <laughs> not knowledge or even power Trees and birds and sunlight. Happiness. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, but to let go. <laughs> no, no that's the. This is. She beat the game. I don't think so. Did you hear that, ominous or have you? It will be his. <laughs> That was all he needed to know. Oh, it's so pretty here. Where is this? It's pretty like it. Stanley stepped through the open door. It's gonna be a screen. How much you wanna bet? It's a screen. Oh. Stanley felt the cool breeze <laughs> upon his skin. The feeling I'm of dead. This is a dream. And then I wake up and I'm in front of that. <laughs> game over. <laughs> Fast exactly game. It's a good stream. <laughs> I've never seen it this one, so I wanted to play this one. Was happy. Is it going to reset itself? or? <laughs> beat the game. I got the achievement. Beat the game. Uh, Nintendo 64. Oh, he's my brother's playing some Nintendo 64. Oh, hey, Chan. Uh, I love how mad that this game makes people. It doesn't bother me at all. No matter how much he talks, it doesn't bother me. His talking doesn't bother me at all, actually. All right, so. How long was I if you don't like his talking, to himself. I don't know what to tell you because he, he's a narrator. Centuries? So, and this while my nobody else turned. talks except for him. He made a note to be more careful. He tells a story from now on. <laughs> I kind of like enjoy. All right, so obviously now I'm gonna try and and be rebellious. Nope. 
When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Let's go back. <laughs> so obviously we're right. I think that's this like the only the thing. This was to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. <laughs> it's so pretty, I love it. What am I playing tomorrow? I don't know. <laughs> I usually stream Skyrim. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It but I'm running out of mods. Quests. Just to spend a few moments here Fire as immaculate, beautifully decent. construct, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his that left. That bugged. On the left? Nah. Just keep on going straight, right? I don't remember. Stanley was so bad at following directions, <laughs> it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Alright. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really. I mean, <laughs> Time flies. I realize like that investing game. your trust in someone That's else like can magic. be difficult, but the fact is <laughs> that the story has been about nothing but you. Jump off the thing. All this time. There's someone you is that a thing I could do? Stanley. Someone who. But in his eagerness <laughs> to prove that he's in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do. Stanley left from the platform and plunged to his death. Good God, like job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. <laughs> I didn't think that was... <laughs> Everyone thinks you're, you're very powerful. <laughs> yeah, screw you, I'm Stanley out of here. came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. I love well. this game. Can I tell you an Easter egg, please? Just to or nah. Um, uh, well, if it's an wow. Easter egg. Yes. This room. Yeah, sure, because I've seen a lot to to business, of this Stanley game already. I mean, not a lot, a lot, but I've seen a good portion. Whoop. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on. Obviously, there's like a zillion ways to do this. <laughs> To say, nah, bro, I ain't gonna listen to you. <laughs> Obtain the razor of the Deidre, of that Deidre Lord. He didn't want to go back to the office. I don't know what he's he called. Wanted to wander about the razor. Even further off track. So what now, in order Lord? to get back, the... he needed to go um, uh, uh, from here. It's um, left. Oh no! Oh, well. <laughs> oh, it's to the right. My mistake. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? <laughs> what was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down... <laughs> Make up your mind! <laughs> yep, yep, okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. Yes. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Convenient. <laughs> Oh wow, it already goes to this. No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, okay. We just we just have to get back to um oh who am I Play Oblivion tomorrow. It's all rubbish. To switch things up. I don't have Oblivion for for PC. Rather than waste my time trying to I think I used to. I don't know what I did with it. Stop the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so God, far off track. Kind of me. What okay, from the top. Wait, does it restart? Does this? Wait, do I get none of that? All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the <laughs> meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. In here. No. <laughs> I imagine I can't really open any doors. Okay. When Stanley wait, wait, wait. Wait, what? No. I think I remember this. No, I restarted. <laughs> I swear I definitely restarted. Shouldn't have game, said that. <laughs> Everything should be What did something change? Stanley. As soon as we started. Did you change started. anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move nah. the story somewhere or a hold on? We'll do that. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. 
Make up your mind. It's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's this find one. the story. Can we jump? I'm gonna go up there. <laughs> um. What the? What the? What the? What? It's like a big, I want to say it's like a maze. Wait. Okay. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. <laughs> do we just, do we need to restart the game again? No, well, no, no, no. <laughs> we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. No, nope. don't. <laughs> Sorry. God damn it, Coco. <laughs> oh, hey, Lone. I just. Sorry, I just thought you're the same blue. All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? <sighs> Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had no, still missed a memo. I have school stuff, too. That's why uh, yesterday. Was it yesterday? No, wait, the day before that. Wednesday. Um, was it Wednesday? Was it Wednesday? I want to say it was yesterday. Yesterday was Wednesday. Um, I have such uh, sporadic classes. Oh, now there's... Okay, yep, it's worse. It's worse. I'm remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is Twitch was down, so I was on still. There was like four viewers for the people who could still get on. So I was... Like, nobody could do it. Wait. We're going backwards? Ugh. Messes. Aha! I knew we'd miss something. The story. Here it comes. What? This one? We're still going this way? Wait. Wait. No, wait. Never mind. Not a story. <laughs> okay, let's head back the it's other Thursday, way. It's Thursday, yes. And retrace our <laughs> I did correct myself. Today is Wednesday. Today is tech. It's kind of like my Friday, though, because I don't have school tomorrow or the next day. Or boxes. There's boxes. Oh, my goodness. This place is... Now, this... Well, I'll be honest. I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't, I don't think so. I'm honestly with. I can't quite recall, but I believe my man story did this. took place in an office building. I think so. Is, is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Would well, you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Yay! <laughs> the pity win. You put in a lot of Great! Work, I mean, really paid off. So totally good. Job. Good job, guys. <laughs> This at all. We both know you didn't put there were four viewers and two of them were nobody. <laughs> fair and square, and this was not one of I like how he got on with both of his accounts, but everyone has like, issues I'm getting, getting on at all. <laughs> it is. I don't care what might happen this time. I, have I can't believe start. I was still streaming. I know I had a little issues towards the end, but like all right, I've got the arrow. This okay, time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help. Of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Yeah! Follow that How line. Is that? Hey, the store is open. It's never open. <clears throat> Don't believe him. <laughs> she got lost in there. <laughs> you will never. <laughs> He'll fuck you See, over. <laughs> the line knows where the story yes. is. Yes, I know he will. Direction. Onward, Stanley. I try to be positive. <laughs> Here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story? Oh, hey, MLP. Sorry, I'm missing some guys. Is the story of no destination still a story? <laughs> Simply by the action of moving forward, <laughs> Wrong <I'm> button. <laughs> journey, such that a destination is inevitably I'm not used to using my by the very manifestation of the fingers. nature of life itself. Okay, Stanley, <laughs> I need to follow fingers. this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now we can both agree that the nature of existence is in fact 
a byproduct of one subjective say, experience the of that existence, too. right? Okay. Now, if my experience of your existence is rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office in fact <clears throat> the skeleton of my own relative experiential <laughs> mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Jenkins. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I yeah. think what we need right now is a bit <laughs> I would of love to play this game drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I can't assume I'm just supposed to go straight. I'm not. Oh. Wait. <laughs> I feel like I'm in like a timber and. Go back and look at that fern. Stanley, this film <laughs> will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss I anything. missed what he say. Do you engage? Everybody's just seeing it. Am I done? Do I have to stare at it more? I'm gonna go. <laughs> Wait, what? We're back at the office? No. No, no. Line. Told you. you do know this, we're looking for the this line is drunk right? tits. The story? <laughs> is any of this ringing a bell? Uh, which way do I go? <laughs> is that game fun? Uh, I'm not gonna message you back, Mason. Ooh. Wait, wrong way. <laughs> Oh, why are you sad, MLP? So, this way then? I assume? Sir, a big ass fucking circle. Oh! Oh, no, 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 not again, mine. How could you well, have done this well, to well, us? Well, 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 well. Oh, I can't take this anymore. Hey, there's one still working. Restart. No! <laughs> Alright, you gonna sober up one? You know what, Go. Stanley? I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent. This people, is where right? you're Why this can't we make this is where you die. Story? Pretty sure this is where I always I'm mysterious. already dead. Ooh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in well, I don't know. How about this direction? Wait, I just heard a door. Oh, <laughs> that's hiding. <laughs> now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, <laughs> a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? I'm going in circles. Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley. That's not even I'm possible. Ready. This isn't possible. <laughs> oh, no, not you again. <laughs> you Stanley. <laughs> like to veto the line from having any role in oh, I just like one of those story. drunk friends. You're no like, it's fun one time, but you come again, come around again. It's just, fine. it's a little annoying. <laughs> Don't have to babysit him. Ah, what a mess. <laughs> Wrecking shit. <laughs> Wait. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is Wait, what? in control. Wait, what? How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. <laughs> so I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere, the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. And that, in turn, means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So That's just a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> he just sputtered. He said, yeah, it's totally what it is. Again. Promise. <laughs> Since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory. Oh, hey, dead dude. I missed Tom him. Stanley. 
Our destiny. What that guy? <laughs> oh, oh. Hold up, what's this? Hmm. 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 Confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is. All right. <clears throat> it's all one I think we've had. Ending. Oops. And we're supposed to restart the game for eight, eight times. Eight, eight times. That's really how all this goes. Stanley dies. <laughs> Spoilers. <laughs> so now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I find a bookstore? Um, can we find that bookstore though? A lot of them have um, Starbucks. Simply because it's written oh, here on this. Ice this coffee sounds good, guys. Wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? They don't Wait, what's get going a say on? in all of this. Is it really? No, it can't who be. Is I, no I don't want guy? it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going don't on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't. So we're just going to stay here. Just sit in the inside go. It. No. <laughs> Stopped. Does that mean um, did we do it? Did we break the schedule? Broke it. <laughs> the, um, whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even Wait. My thing just stopped. I had to be very cautious with this stupid thing. It hates me. Twitch hates me. Just straight up. Can you guys still see me? Because I'm still getting chat. But Twitch won't come up in another page. <clears throat> I'll see you in the internet. You guys are just in your own little world over there in chat land. <laughs> if you guys still see it, I'll still keep on going. You're still in line. Do you still see me though? <laughs> Because, like, I've had this issue in the past where people could still see me, but, well, when I pass, I mean, Tuesday? Is it Tuesday? I think it was Tuesday. Yeah, it's still up. Okay, cool. I'll, 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 I'll continue. Ah, shit. OBS. Is chat still up? Everything's still going? I don't know why. Twitch hates me, though. Great. No. Will someone come for us? Will something happen? We can just stay here. So, you can, um... Okay. I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story. Wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Ooh, though they're always so saying that life is about drink. the journey and not <clears throat> the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime... <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't expecting that. <laughs> what did like carpet come All find his you? All co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I don't trust any of this. <laughs> Will you go? Uh, did you go MLG? What does that mean? Should I know when this? Stanley came to a set of two open doors. He entered the door on his left. Uh, no. <laughs> this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. I'm hoping that that line just shows up. The lounge was sublime. 
Hey, Prime. What was it about or Rage? <laughs> so I don't know what to tell you. To get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Mm. Is that opening over there? No. I don't want it to close on me. Wait, wait. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. <laughs> yeah, screw your directions. Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. <laughs> I'm not your enemy, really. I'm uh, I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, <laughs> but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you Oh, Major League Gaming. Time. Oh, yeah, I knew that. <laughs> I have a wristband that says I'm and everything. Stop trying to make any decision by yourself. <laughs> I knew that. I'm not asking for me. I'm asking for her. No, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I have that wristband because it's a loot crate. <laughs> it's like you to can believe. To work aside. To let her back into your life. Who? She's been waiting. Oh. Uh. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another... I think I remember. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm hooked it. I've never got to listen to it. <clears throat> what just happened? Oh, Stanley, is that you? Uh, hold on, sweetie. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just pulling the bread out of the oven. Oh, Actually, hi. fresh bread is delicious. <laughs> okay, there we go. Alright now, I want you to come in and tell me all about your day. Oh yeah. <laughs> gotcha. I just did. <laughs> did you actually think you had a Oh this happened. Life? That well, lag though. <laughs> I'm trying to make a point here, Stanley. I'm trying to get you to see something. <laughs> come inside. Let me show you what's really going on here. This is a very sad story about the death trust of a man Stanley. I can't even get closer. <laughs> Press Y and keep on. Now. <laughs> Press everything about Y. No. What if I just sit here? What's up, wifey? How's it going? Hey, Stuart. How's it going? <clears throat> Bit late. What is it? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Jolly, why are you writing? Nice. No, Stanley making... is quite a boring fellow. He has a job that demands but nothing. Like on a more. painting. And every button or that a pushes photo. is a reminder of the inconsequential That's pretty, um, nature of his existence. Spices things up. Why is this here? Look at him there, pushing buttons, doing exactly what he's told to do. Now he's pushing a button. Now is it the Skyrim Shuffle? <laughs> Too bad nobody is in here. <laughs> he now loves that. <laughs> he's coming back to work. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. Mm. Yeah. I think I clicked on accident. What just happened? I broke it. I broke it. <laughs> I just slammed on buttons. <laughs> oh. God damn it, I wanted to watch the TV. <laughs> lies. Nothing but lies. Oh. Cheat cheese for everyone, yes. <laughs> Can I see what's in the I don't want to. <laughs> what is a Sims without the actual Sims? <laughs> Just sit here. Get it done over with. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Skyrim Shuffle is so mean. <laughs> or I could just prepare dinner. No! <laughs> Seven. Mm. 
The cake is a lie. The cake is a lie. That cake, I want to try and recreate that cake for somebody's birthday. <laughs> it looks so delicious. I want... And really easy. Come on. What? Why is it coming so, so slow? Scum Shuffle's hilarious. <laughs> I introduced that to everybody. <laughs> I want to go to the bedroom. Flip it. Flip it. Flip it. <laughs> I could just say it. I have no voice, apparently. Uh, Miley's in your basement. Are you talking about Miley Cyrus? Mm -hmm. That's kind of creepy. Actually, it would be creepy if it, if anything, that's just creepy. It's weird. Unless it's a, like, a dog, and that's where they're supposed to be. What's going on? Oh, bye, Psycho. Is everybody else having issues? Because I can't even see it. Because I'm not close to any servers, and I think that might be why I have issues. Like I do. To question nothing. I don't want to question nothing. Nothing is nothing, and just keep it at that. <sighs> What are you even talking about, MLP? <sighs> How long does this take? I just, <laughs> this is. Mm. <laughs> oy, 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 oy. It's fine. Ooh. Can you make it go faster? I just want to leave. I just want out of here. <laughs> I'm going crazy. I don't want this ever again. <laughs> Man, you're right. I should have touched that phone. <laughs> I'm stuck here forever. No. <laughs> uh. <laughs> What's happening? I don't know. I'm waiting for commands to push the buttons. The buttons I have to push. Stanley's job. I have to do Stanley's job because I'm Stanley. <sighs> no wonder I want to kill myself so much. MLP, please be nice to other people who are in the chat or I will time you out. I have no qualms about that. Please, if you're in a bad mood, don't bring it on to anybody else in the chat. Don't listen to me or anything. The lag, though, it didn't even pop up till I was already here. <laughs> no one would give me anything. I broke it. I broke it. I broke it. <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> the matrix is real. The metrics. <laughs> now she has to go to school where. Ooh, yeah. That sucks, but please, I, and I know that you're in a bad mood, and that sucks, I understand. But please don't be rude to other people in my chat. I'm done. <laughs> There's nothing I can do. Should I restart it? I think I broke it. I broke it. I'm just gonna say I broke it. I broke it. <laughs> I don't remember being stuck in there like that. Uh, wait. Wait, what? You're supposed to do that. 
What? <laughs> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no. <laughs> this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Hey, Chef. Standing now in this incredible room, Stanley for the first time <laughs> understood true happiness. Cool. Then the, the feeling went away, and he felt sad. Uh, dollar twenty-five for a can. And lingered Rip for a minute off. or two. Now it's only half there, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his. You're left. gonna go because you don't like rude people. Who is uh, being rude all together? Because I would very much like them to stop or them be timed out. Stanley was so bad at following directions, <clears throat> it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. What's down that? Can I go down that? No, oh, Stanley, no. I think perhaps we've gotten uh, off on the wrong foot here. I'm not wait, your wait. enemy, really. I'm wait, wait. not. I wanted to do the left. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult. <laughs> like, I want to try and make it. The story has been about nothing <laughs> but you. What? Really? <laughs> in the middle of something, do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why? I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a Which one should I take, now, guys? We have to, I'm going to wait for you guys. Stanley what Watt, do you want me to door. take? I'll let you guys decide. The red pill or the blue pill? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't want to talk. Yeah, I would just drop that all and just we're trying to enjoy ourselves. The blue, blue, the red, blue. I don't remember which one goes to the matrix. I don't remember. I want to say the blue one. I think the blue one does. God, it's been a long time. The red color is, the color. of course you would think that, Dawn, <laughs> blue. We're gonna go blue. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey! Stanley walked through the red door. <laughs> I still don't think we're communicating. <laughs> Stanley walked through the red door. That's a pretty arrow, but nah. <laughs> All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? Next time, I'll have to do that again and have to go to that road, red one. You've chosen well. Don't let me stop you. You see? There's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first <laughs> place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? <laughs> Is it yes. worth ruining the entire yes. thing I did not specifically <laughs> for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and <laughs> desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You yes. Me absolutely nothing <laughs> Work so on far. it. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design, and you can give me some feedback. Oh, God, I'm scared. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. <laughs> go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Yeah! I'm scared. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the <laughs> game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real well, critical feedback here. Um... I really like okay, it. Okay, so we're it getting does. somewhere. <laughs> Clearly there's something here that speaks to you. If I can be honest here, I really don't have any idea where I'm going with this. This whole third door thing was just a Is there an dark. objective to you? But I guess no. You're into, so <laughs> let's get this party train Beat going. the narrator. Here, That's my objective. <laughs> playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. 
Let's take a look. What? Wait. Into a sequence into the crystal. Choose the blue door. This is you. <laughs> huh. Can I go back down here again? <laughs> Freedom. Oh. <laughs> Would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. <laughs> you should just say yes. <laughs> hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity <laughs> to give it some Freedom. Oh. <laughs> you wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. This is a restarting, I swear to God. <laughs> oh. This game, the baby crawls left towards danger. <laughs> you click the button to move him back to the right. And if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the only Look at that baby. <laughs> notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. Are you serious? I swear to god, if you could do this. <laughs> you heartless bastard. <laughs> Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing. This is funny though, I love it. For me. I'm not even going to try. It's the best. I'm, out, I'm, out, I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game just to ease the pain? Let's see. What do we have here? Mm -hmm. Cook me. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. I swear to God, if this restarts. <laughs> Is any better? At last, the one thing you've always desired. I can't jump game though. I had absolutely nothing to do with. But is it enough? <laughs> I found my Minecraft. Will it ever be enough? Well, I can't this. jump. I'm done making things for you. From now on, I will only create to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. I love it. <laughs> this will go. Here, no, here, and then. <laughs> Let's watch him build, build a house. Does it need iron? Yes, of course. And just to finish it all off. Yes. It's a beautiful it's house. It did such a good job. Can I go I in there? Understand. Look at it. Gaze <laughs> upon beautiful. my work of art Love it. and feel ashamed <laughs> at your own inadequacy. Ah, but you've only seen it from the outside. You've only gotten half the experience. Yeah, I won't go in. Please step inside and make yourself comfortable. Yeah, I can't. Wait. Wait. Go. <laughs> I don't think I can go in. I can't. I'm too tall. <laughs> I think I can't do this. Isn't it grand? I have to go inside. It, <laughs> it could only be better if... Wait, that's it. We must rebuild it out of diamond. Yeah. Diamond everything. Yes, yes, yes. Come along, Stanley. We have to go mining. He's still my game. Yes. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. What are we doing? Go mining? Yeah, let's go mine. <laughs> It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? No. Don't you have one? What's those? I don't know what those are. Oh, no, 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 no. 
This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Something that makes you feel utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Even the diamonds couldn't save this one. I think I heard okay, a spider new or game. something. What? <laughs> Dirt house. <laughs> what door? <laughs> That's about as... <laughs> Portal! <laughs> yes, I don't even know what this game is, but I love I... it. You, trapped in a glass box with no way out, listening to me talk. Oh, it's inspired. I love I Portal. I <laughs> myself. What is this game even That's something I should be? play. I, I should stream this Portal. Okay, I have both of them now. now. Let's go find I should play some with my brother. Wait. Oop. It's a puzzle. I, Critical thinking. I need Stanley. this. Give me my companion please. Genius. Genius. Absolutely no, remarkable. You know hey. I think that's plenty. I really don't care much to see you stumble through any more of these. No. And I highly doubt you're any wiser. I love this game. Which is why, rather than continue to waste my time, I'm just going to leave <laughs> you here. You can pretend you've beaten the game if it makes it any richer for you, but as for me, I've had enough. So, why don't you get cozy in this room, and if you have any grand revolutionary ideas for the like, perfect video I'm game, you can just that sit I there and let it ball up inside you Can you change the... There is my sort of sassy black woman. <laughs> I, don't I would love that. Ratings. And I certainly don't need the validation of a man <laughs> whose job is to push buttons. I think I'll just I'm a rebellious a man who is jobs to push back. contributions to the world. <laughs> and perhaps every now and then I'll think back to a man named Stanley who was wrong in every decision he ever made. The thought won't last long. Goodbye, Stanley. Good luck with your work. And I sincerely hope that everyone I had to kill myself to end this. I see it down there. <laughs> Wait! Oh! What? What? I can't see anything. Okay, I really can't see anything. It's so dark. And there's a light. Okay, let me... Let me close my window. The blinds on it. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. Okay, how do you change this to sit down? No way, I want that sassy black lady. All right. Wait. Which way did I come from? <laughs> I've been playing Diablo three. Get Diablo three. Um. Mm. Ooh, so many doors and choices. I love this. It's like a maze. It's just so dark. I wonder if I can, uh... Uh... Build a vision. I don't know if that's gonna do anything. I'm gonna worry about it right now. I'll probably be out of here in a sec. It's so dark. Hey, Dell. Or get your dad to stream it. I don't know if he would, though. A bit. Oh. The light at the end of the tunnel. I don't trust you, light. 
Good lord. Control panel? Just blue. Push stuff? Push stuff. What? <laughs> he really left me, guys. The narrator really left me. <laughs> I wonder what he found. <laughs> if what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. Is this the ending? I wonder if he's happy with his choice. And if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. I wonder how many endings there really are. Trying to tell him. He needs me. I hope there's someone who will wrap everything up at the end them. to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. <clears throat> That's who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very soon. I can wait. Yes, we're waiting. So, how is everybody? I actually really enjoyed this game. I really like it. It's, I think it's hilarious. Coco is dead. <laughs> I love how long this this running joke has uh, been. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? The Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Charlie is dead. Oops. What is that button for? I did a lot of clicking. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly. Oh, and I'm Perhaps almost positive there's the numerous suicide ones, because I've already Just done one. <laughs> All right, be Stanley. Stanley felt lightheaded, butterflies in his stomach, giddy in a way he had never known before. <laughs> Was it this room? A connection between the two? Could a man This coffee, the room? perhaps? I mean truly And this mug. Truly Oops, wrong button. Deeply. What does it say? Madly. What does love. it say? Coffee that. I need that. <laughs> yeah, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Nah, bruh. <laughs> Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. I should just do it again. <laughs> perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story is... What? <laughs> really? <laughs> I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced? I should have just kept on going because it looked, sounded like he was what? gonna. I don't know how to convince you of this. I wonder if I just I really keep on do doing it if it restarts to show you itself. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on. We should do the red one this time. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully. This is important. Stanley walked through the red door. <laughs> should I do? I think I'm gonna go through the red one this time. Oh, thank God, you are willing to listen to me. Do you see that I really have wanted you to be happy all this time? The problem is all these choices. The two of us always trying to get somewhere that isn't here. Running and running and running. <laughs> and going in circles. Right this is stupid. Killing us, Stanley. I just this is impossible. I, stop. I would we would both be so much. This is impossible. If we just <laughs> and I think well, I think I have a solution. Here, let me show you. Ooh. 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 <laughs> Cut the red one this time. That's what I did. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, see ya, dead dude. What do we want? What are we looking for? What is, that? Hmm? What is it? Whoa. If we just stay right here, right in this moment, with this place, Stanley, 
I think I feel happy. I actually feel happy. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna kill me. I feel like I might be being abducted or something. I can't jump off. <laughs> I don't like it anymore. You can stop now. No, wait. Where are you going? <laughs> oh no. Stay away from those stairs. If you hurt yourself, if you die, the game will reset. We'll lose all of this. <laughs> Please, no, Stanley, let me stay here. Don't take this from me. <laughs> Please, Stanley, think about what you're doing. I'm gonna, any more? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> you lick gross. Look. No! Oh, thank God, you lived. <laughs> you lived. You me worried there for a moment. Now, can we please get back to the other room? Whoa. Dude, there. someone's on acid. <laughs> this is what you want. This is where we can both be happy. We really can. If we stop moving, we just have to stop moving. <laughs> Stanley, go back. There's nothing good that can come from this. Let's <laughs> try this again. No. no, no, what do you... Do you just not believe me? What can I say to convince you? I love this. This is the greatest. It's like throwing a little tantrum. It's like, I don't want to do that. <laughs> no. <laughs> I just said, don't do it. I'm going to do it. I've got to, I've got to jump. Stanley, <laughs> let's go back to the other room. Can you do that for me? Yes. Perhaps you can. It gets That's weird every time. I'm talking about. I know you'll see. Uh, you'll see that we can't be happy if we leave this place. You can see that, can't you? Uh, everything's so fuzzy. You don't like it. No, perhaps not. <coughs> Ew, that was gross. Um, I need a drink. My God. Is this really how much you dislike my game? That you'll throw yourself from this platform over and over to be rid of it? You were literally willing to kill yourself to keep me from being happy. Am I reading the situation correctly? So sad. <laughs> I wonder what happens if I just go back out there. such a trip. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, do <dear. laughs> Hey, Joe. Now I'm going to kill myself. This is taking too long to progress the story. <laughs> Cause I didn't do anything. I don't even think he's. <laughs> Maybe you're just getting a kick out of it. I don't know anymore. I just wanted us to get along. But I guess that was too much to ask. This is literally, I had to, to self-harm myself to get out of here. it over. It's going to restart, isn't it? I'm going back. I think I just restarted the game. <laughs> Dead. Hmm. 
The meeting room? Yes, that's where everyone would be. Stanley just needed to get to the meeting room, and from then on, he would it's never still... be alone ever again. I'm still again. playing it. It's different dialogue. <laughs> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was grand, majestic, perhaps majestic. too majestic. Too like a combination majestic. of a much smaller version and a much larger version of this exact room. It all made Stanley uncomfortable, and he started to bleed a little. <laughs> this made him smile. At last, proof that he was human. <laughs> what? <laughs> what but even? Eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Is like padding somehow? Really oh yeah, there's a wind, there's that, that that's open. I trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. Please, stop trying to make every decision. I am not talking to her I'm again. Not asking for me. I'm no. Asking for her. Open this door. Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself, to put your Screw that lady, aside, I don't like her. To let She's her back mannequin. into your life. She's married a mannequin. Jesus. That's her, Stanley. No. You need to be the one to. Oh, no, 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 you can't. Did you I... just unplug the phone? <laughs> Screw that phone. wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? How did you, you actually do... chose incorrectly? I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> let me double check. No, it's definitely here, clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. Nope. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, and the two pledge themselves to one another. Music nope. comes in. She made me bread that wasn't even credits. there. Not picking up the phone. That is actually somehow is important for me. <laughs> Fresh bread. You say you're gonna have it. Have it. <laughs> I don't understand. No trust. <laughs> How are you making meaningful choices? What did you? Wait a second. Did I just see? No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? You're not Stanley. You're a real person. <sighs> oh, I no. I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. Oh, it's God. a you completely ignored in uh, basic safety. Oh, God. I know. Decision making, <laughs> or did you not grasp the severity of Phones. the situation? Well, Don't. I won't have that kind of risk on Phones my watch. Phone's not plugged in. I'm going to stop the yeah, because I unplugged it. So we can educate you properly <laughs> on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Choice. It's the best part of hey, being you guys a have real to read person. this stuff. But if used incorrectly, Actually, it can it. also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Stephen has or a choice. Listen, I remember he could spend years listen. helping improve the quality of life for citizens of impoverished yeah. third world nations. Or he could systematically set fire to every orphan living in a 30 kilometer radius of his house. Which <laughs> choice would you make? Remember hmm. that unlike here, the real world makes sense. And at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their <laughs> thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, My goodness, is it 4.30? I'm goodness. supposed to be having a back sack and crack. A back sack and crack. <laughs> practice. Excellent. I'm supposed to be the having a back sack and crack. on a regular crack. basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. Totally Most medical professionals logical. recommend <laughs> making at least eight choices it. per day. Do you make eight. more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, just remember, 
that in the vast <laughs> infiniteness of space, your Not thoughts really. and problems are materially insignificant, and the feeling should subside. At this it's time, third world your instructor countries. will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Ah, welcome back. We broke it. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. Now I gotta flip tables. Not flip to it. Worry. <laughs> now that you're properly informed on good decision making, the game's writing. I feel like it's like just a few minutes ago, and see what the right <laughs> thing to do would have been. This way, please. Here, give me a sec, guys. Let's switch. Switch, switch, switch. <clears throat> I really want to get a soda from downstairs. Just having issues loading. What? Whoops. Ah, dick balls. Ugh, I forgot. <laughs> cool. Will it be a you guys are so weird. I can't even want, like read chat really. <laughs> you guys are on your own little heads. Can I go backwards? Let's go backwards. Now that we know your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. Imagine Oh, the oh hey look there's a king on it now. The story. Scooter skate. Take it off. Story. Take it off! Just need to get you home no. as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets No! Unfortunately, it seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. <laughs> mm. Now go this way. Go down. I want that. There is some way to get down there. I want to know what it is. They guys out. You guys aren't making sense anymore. You guys are doing your own stuff, and I'm like, I don't. I don't know what's going on. What is that? Almost there. You'll take the door on the left back to the correct ending. <laughs> He's closing all the doors. Once again, and you'll me. be home free in the real world. You're so weird, Tom. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. I feel like a little kid throwing a tantrum. <laughs> no. Doors, he entered the door on his left. No. <laughs> no. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. Open this one. I remember I, it looped. Fine. 
I will find a door that finally opens. Oh, it's ruined. You <laughs> after everything we talked about, that you, my story, you've destroyed my work. Why? Hey, Bobby. What? what did you get out of that? What did you think was so <laughs> special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage. It, well, it's worthless now. This. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, not would it be worth it? Out? To know that my story is now yeah. incorrect? Yeah. <laughs> back to that. Break. I can't Break erase it. that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. Reliving its impossibility forever. Oh, I couldn't live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? <laughs> to willingly destroy all my work? I'm, I don't know. I don't What's know. Answer? What do I do? Grr everywhere. Grr everywhere. I have to. I have to. Don't. Nope. I don't know what's going on in chat. But I'm playing the Stanley Parable. <laughs> and I'm breaking the game. I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. Grr everywhere. <laughs> Inspiring words. Now look where we are. My entire game is destroyed. It was the only thing in the world that was mine, and you run it into the ground. Yay! What, did you think that would be funny? You just yeah. had to see? Didn't I impress Love upon it. you how important it was to be like Stanley? He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? That there's a world outside of you? You're a child. Oh. My story. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It oh, I wanted so to perfect. do that again and then turn it so off. I forgot I wanted so hard. to do that again. <clears throat> Obama, probably. Exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry! This is where exactly it looped away this man. Responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. Spain? <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two Probably open doors, he entered the door on his left. Even with some bright lights. Ugh. Gross. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. Ugh, almost made it. <laughs> Don't give it this time. Standing. Always right. That means choosing responsibly. Always right. Always putting the but story first. <laughs> I don't I'm think that's sure a choice. The task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. How All many right. times do I have to do it? When came is this to actually a bug or is this? Doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. <laughs> You're getting really bad connection? Is it because you're in Spain? That means choosing responsibly and always Spanish internet. The I'm sure you'll be internet the connection. Task. I'm just, just kidding. That's terrible. Right. Is this a Half Life 2 mod or is it really game? Stan? It's a. Uh, I think it's like. They made it from. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. Oh, that's right. It's a super mod. Exactly super mod. Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the. If I'm gonna do this, I need a soda. <laughs> Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Well, there's two more times, and I'm gonna go get a soda. Go in the left, and then go back exactly into the right one. Would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two But it closes doors, behind me. Entered the door on his left. Most of the time they close. 
I don't want it to close. It's gonna close on me. Nobody, I swear to God, if it closes. Here. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Let me out. <laughs> In a couple of years. I like how you guys were at each other's throats at the beginning <laughs> of this game. Yet there was not a single person mm. here either. <laughs> I'm just gonna mop on the floor. Uh, decided to go up I hate you, nobody. Office, <laughs> he might find an answer there. <laughs> so mad. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs. There was an up and downstairs. Um, so next time I'm gonna go downstairs. There's a like a zillion things I want to do with this game. Hmm. Oh man. Who even has? What? It doesn't even. Stepping inside his manager's office, oh, it's a panda was painting. To discover not an indication of any human life. <laughs> Nobody can Stanley wondered in uh. disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a I bet you the boss comes out and just stands up here like this. Behind this door with his arms behind his back. To his questions. <laughs> and beyond all probability, just thinking he about things. Code. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Stanley had been trained never to speak up, but now he would draw Night from shark? himself the courage one, to face the unknown. One four? He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. I can't. What code? No. Screw you, narrator. <clears throat> Stanley spoke the code. <laughs> Night Shark 115. He spoke it into the receiver the panda. right there on the wall. I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't mishear me, did you? Please speak the code into the receiver. Otherwise, we can't get on with the story. This is a crucial step. Okay, fine, you're not gonna do it, but you know what? It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I asked you for this one single thing, for your respect. The kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story seriously. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the hell you wanted over there. The hell you, you wanted. <laughs> Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his bed. Look at that. Stanley, Stanley looks so confused. Are you Question life. Okay. Question that life. I, yeah, I sit there questioning. Choice. No. I wonder if I. Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. He's like, he's broken. Sure. You broke Stanley. God damn it, narrator. You broke him. This is more important than you can ever know. I need this. The story needs it. So, you hear me? Are you there? You listening to this? Stanley, are you there? I wonder if you wait. I want to make sure you get everything. Oh, 
Hello? Yes? What? Give me that, guys. Give me a sec. Whoops. All right. Let me do something real quick. Add scene. set this back up. There. Alright, I'll be right back. <laughs> I don't have any music because I don't think it's going to be very long. you in my room. <sighs> Did the, that picture not come up? Maybe it doesn't come up until I have I reset it. Sorry. I thought it was going to come up. I haven't like fully reset uh, all my OBS settings. I thought I did, but they did not. I missed stuff, sorry. Ugh. Tell whoever it was to stream. Oh, that's my other little sister. I have two little sisters. Uh, my littlest sister plays Diablo. Nobody else in this house plays video games. <laughs> they don't. I don't live with them. Oh, hey, Tuff. When did you come in? All right. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply... I don't know if she... I think she plays more WoW, though. I technically don't need this. It's all backwards anyways, is it? No. Technically, don't need this, but I feel like it is backwards. That seems very off balanced. When Stanley came to a set of two open Let's... doors, he entered the door on his left. I 
I did want to try and turn on the brain control Feeling stuff. Feeling the wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Wait. Hoping he'd nope. come into a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Nope. But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. He might and do Diablo instead, and to stream it. <laughs> I don't think she'd like to, to do it. All because he believed everyone had vanished. She's a huge His boss fan. would think he was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason at all. None of it made any logical sense. When am I in Silent Hill? pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Why did, did I usually see them? Automatically behind him wherever he went. And for that matter, these rooms were starting question. to look okay. pretty familiar. Were they simply repeating? No, Stanley said to himself, this is Which one plays Diablo? She does play Diablo. But, last, but not very often. That had been on At least not that I have he just I just know that she plays a lot of WoW. I'm dreaming! Yeah. yeah! This is all a dream! Yeah, screw oh, this! What a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. No, he thought to himself, that one I love it. She doesn't soon. play any. To go back to my boring real life job pushing I don't buttons. understand. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. Ironically, so, she um, imagined himself flying. Plays a began to gently float above the ground. Whoa! Then he imagined himself soaring through space on a magical star field, and it too appeared. <laughs> it was so much fun, and Stanley marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. One he was amazed Tell her he hadn't that. asked himself sooner. Why is there a voice in my head dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming about a voice Jack wants describing it now. me, thinking about how it's describing my thoughts, he thought. And while he thought it all very odd, and wondered if this voice spoke to all people in their dreams. The truth was that, of course, this was not a dream. How could it be? Was Stanley simply deceiving himself? Believing no, that Jack. if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility for himself? Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Now, hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. Oh, I was hoping he could go backwards. He knew for certain, beyond a <gasps> doubt, that this was, in fact, a dream. Did the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. That this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently. And he invited himself to wake up. He felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin. The press of the mattress on his back. Stand up to Jack. The fresh Stand air of the world outside this one. Let me wake up. Morgan. He to himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please. It's all I want. Oh, hey, hey, dead dude. I want Welcome my back. apartment and my wife and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. <laughs> my life is normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. I am okay. No, there's only one. <laughs> Stanley began screaming. Please, someone wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss, I have an office, I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real, I must be. Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. No. This is the story of a woman named You have Mariella. a slight diction to it, nobody? I think we... Mariella woke up <laughs> on a day like any other. 
She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. Dead. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy, this much she knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was but to be not normal. For me. I am sane. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. It was comforting to think this, and in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. But then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career, and by extension, the rest of her life. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down at the body. And then she You're holding it in. Yes, please do, Don. Please do. We've seen it. I've witnessed it. I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Uh, will you block that? When Stan came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. And here it was, the lounge. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Mm -hmm. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. Yeah. So in order to get back, he needed to go. Uh, uh, you turned him out. It's um left. <laughs> oh no, no, it's to the right. My mistake. No, 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 no. What game right. should I play? Why would I have ever I'm said it was game. to the right? What was I thinking? If you say Diablo clearly... three. Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yeah, yep. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. Okay. Okay. No, no, oh, no, no, I didn't no, know that no, this no, was no, no. this is right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close Shit. your eyes. Okay, okay, Alright, okay, I need to get out of here. Diablo 2. Too. <laughs> it's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay. From the top. Uh, all right. Well, I didn't want to do that one again. I didn't. I thought there was a way out of a different. A different all way. of his co-workers were gone. Um. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Some of these are still on. When Stanley, wait, wait, what? No. I no, no I didn't. I swear, I definitely restarted the game. I don't want to replay this fresh. one. Everything should be. <laughs> oh, oh, All right, we're gonna begin the game again because I didn't want to replay this one. I thought there was a option to lead off of it. Well, I think Stanley is actually a crazy person. That could be very well it. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I think what I have to do is 
get really close to the end of the normal one. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I think my favorite ending was the portal slash Minecraft Yet there was not one. a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, tips for not getting by. Talk less. Do unbelievably office, amazing work all the time. Find an answer there. How to solve dispute? Let it ball up inside you. Talking about <laughs> passive aggressive. Is that coworkers for not supporting you more? Sounds about right. It's very using slides to assure employees that everything is okay. Make sure your sli your slide has a slick graphic in the header and <laughs> throw some bevel. Everyone is you. You must. You must of all. Jack, no. Number of slides on this. Charts. Charts of this in slides. Slides. <laughs> Stanley just stood there doing nothing at all. He seems to think I have nothing better to do with my time than to sit around and describe every fascinating little detail of his inability. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Jackie really wants it. Give me a second. He's been being very, very persistent. still find a way, aren't you? You're very determined. Hey, Quantum! Alright. So we're gonna get to the very... What I really wanted to do... What was it? The... Okay, I'll do that next time. I knew you were gonna find a way. I knew it. I'm like a bathroom. Well, well, I've got the feeling money's for stealing, but not yours, of course. Jack, stop. What does that say? So that's a lovely purse. It has to be a option in here. This bathroom? <laughs> yeah. Jack. Jack always wins. He'll always find a way. He's like sitting on my ear. You gave in to Jack. He just does. He won, Katie. He won. He's just gonna be annoying. Jack. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. What could it mean? Stanley wondered aloud to me. <laughs> he began that mic still goes into my ear. On the boss's desk, pulling books off the shelf, looking behind paintings, desperate for clues to his situation. But his attention no. was caught by a keypad behind the boss's desk. What could Jackie, its be? Jack just wants more screen fact, time, <laughs> right? A terrible secret that lay buried below his feet, and so the boss You're had making it. an extra secret. There's no reason now to have Two, this canvas. Eight, four, You're five. laying on it. But of course, Stanley couldn't possibly. Here, here's another canvas. Lay on this one. Lay on this one. Stanley just sat around twiddling his thumbs. Trying to input anything on the device was useless, since he could never possibly know that the combination was 2845. Nope. I don't know that. There's a scary camera. Shit's real. I ain't gonna do that. I will take one of these. Oh. 2845. I want a job, like a desk job like this, where I could just have like, I don't know, like these just sitting around. <laughs> No, I said I'm not going to do it. Forgot 
but it turns out that the panel's emergency override kicked in and the door and what's the point all by itself and Stanley got the hell along with the story got the hell what along with it you just got annoyed Jack, you are, you're like, <laughs> there is no reason. <laughs> it's hard to balance you and this kid. <laughs> He's going sack of potatoes on me. He's like, no. <laughs> Come on. Go over here, look. I know you like split laying on flat surfaces. Come here. Come here. You can lay on this. Ooh, flat surface. Ooh, flat surface. Lay down. Lay down. See, you like it. No. <laughs> can your dad stream? I don't know. I haven't talked to him in a while. <laughs> uh. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this Jackie! Had the word escape so on it, the truth persistent. Was, but at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. He's literally pushing my hand. <laughs> He's doing a mouse, basically. <laughs> not anymore. Don't. Jackie. The door behind him was not Stop. shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Your dog's the same. At this point, Intention Stanley was more. making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Jack. Dead. Oh. Uh. 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 As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his math. Eyes, he I actually really enjoy my math class. No I always like Stanley math. Can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story. Can Jack. You exited out of my game, you dick. <laughs> you cannot be on my lap at the same time. There's only so much lap. <laughs> so you can watch this. You can do it si simultaneously. Simultaneously. But I think I can talk. Well, the twists and turns. Okay, <laughs> I really cannot have you over here. Like, that was not an invitation. <laughs> Take the hint. Okay, I'll move this. Now lay down. Just, just cool. It's cool. Just, just watch from there. Forever in his oh, what this really is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. Jack wants to play the eyeballs. He's never seen the eyeballs. No. To his brief and no. Life. No. 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 Stop. 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 No. Farewell, Stanley cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed he every did it on purpose. in his body, killing him instantly. <laughs> and yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. Oh, I remember this. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? 
how to take when over the world. He's like, oh, I can exit out of the game. Now I know how, first. basically. Death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? I remember seeing Do you this see that um, Stanley when Man was played. already dead from the moment he hit start. He's dead all the time. All the time, every time. Every time, all the time. Is there a sequence on this? A selection of the sound used throughout the game. Cool. What's happening? I broke the game. That's what happened. It looks like there's a Tron version. I want that version. Warzone. Huh. Jack, listen to the girl. Oh, girl. He can't hear anything. Trying to see how many, like, like, how would I get to all these? Let's just leave. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Can you see? Mm -mm. Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. But listen to me. You can still save these two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push how? And press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. Should I? <laughs> I pressed it. Should I you Pepsi? It's delicious. I'm cold. Actually cold Pepsi's the best. It's my treat of the day. No, Jack. You wanted it in here so badly. You're staying in here. I don't even know where uh give me a sec. Is good. I have no idea what Joss is. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now. And be I don't think there is. I, I don't want to. Do choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let time. <laughs> Was that good timing or what? I don't think it really did anything. I was really hoping it would do something. It said to quit. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Dang it, I thought there was gonna be something. Ah, <laughs> now Jack's got like, I got like cat hair on my face. Crystal Pepsi was awesome. I don't know what that is. Was that the blue one? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. 